<laughs> okay, listen, here's the deal. We're gonna try this one more time. It's like five o'clock. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna build an ax because I, I gotta, I have to, well, I don't have to. I, I'm working is what I'm doing. So I thought, you know what? I'm gonna try this with the iPhone. If it works, it works. If it doesn't, it doesn't. If it goes blank, we're done for the night. I'm not gonna worry about it. But I'm not gonna answer a lot of comments because I'm working on an ax. You can just put it in the background and watch it go ahead. Stillborn. I'm gonna see if I can get the comments coming up on here. What do you guys think? I don't think it's gonna work. I'm gonna see if I can get the comments on here and work on my ax. So how do I know when I'm live? How do you find out how you're live on your own YouTube channel? There we go, found it. There I am. Okay, oh I see the, there you guys are. Hey, hey. I see you now, stillborn, stillborn. Coops, coops, coops. Dan the Firewood Man. How you doing, buddy? How's it going, Dan? Chuck85. Hey, Stillborn, how are you doing, buddy? Man, those suspenders are the ticket, I'll tell you that right now. This is what we're working on. It's got a, um, it's actually, it's a beautiful ax. On, on these jerseys, friends, a, a, lot of, a lot of folks ask me questions. Yeah, it's a nice little ax. It, it's, I cleaned her all up. It, it's sharper than hell. I already got me a couple times. I gotta start putting something on there so I don't get gashed up. We tried to go live like four times, three times, and the Wi-Fi went. So if the screen goes black, friends, just, I won't be back. I'm just going to try it one more time, but I'm just going to work. You know what I'm saying? Just going to work. Yeah. Adam, how you doing? Taylor. Yeah, there's Taylor. Hey, hey, Taylor, ask that stillborn. He's got some, he's got some good suggestions. He got me going on the suspenders. How you doing, Tim's Tin Man? How are you, buddy? Yeah, boy. Yeah, I'm home. Okay, buddy. I could bring you guys over here, I guess, eh? What do you think? You guys want to come over here? Is it better over here for you guys? Like right here? Is that better for you guys? We're going for it again. We're going to give it a shot, friends. I tried three times earlier and my Wi-Fi calfed every single time. That's better? Oh, there's the bellhopper. Okay, good. How are you doing, buddy? Okay, this is better, okay. 
We're using my iPhone. We're back to the iPhone now. I don't know what's going on with the rest of this stuff. I don't know. But I'm building an act, so I'll do my best to kind of flip back and forth talking to the, you guys in that. I felt bad because we got ripped off, so I'm just going to try it. Seems like what I did is I went on the videos to see how fast the videos came up. You know when they lag? When you're doing that and they lag, that's when you know that your Wi-Fi's struggling. Well, they seem to be coming in pretty quick, so I figured I'd try it one more time. Let's give it a shot. So I'm building an axe. I'm building a 30-inch handle. Jersey hacks. I've done quite a bit of the work already on the on the hafting. We're just about there. But I just I hammered on that, friends. And I've got a teeny bit left before I hit the shoulder, which is what I want right here. I want this to come up a bit. Know what I mean? I'm not quite there. I need it to come up. Oh yeah. What do you mean practice is key, stillborn? Aren't you supposed to just be good, jump in the tree and go? Isn't that how this is supposed to go, this game? I thought you just put the gear on and away you went. I don't understand. Hey, Lyle Davis, thanks, buddy. <laughs> hey, saw a lot of bucking stock shirts. Oh, did you? Did you? That's awesome. Good news, Lyle. Thanks, buddy. I love it. Yeah, there you go, Stillborn. Yeah. Well, I'll tell you, uh, my kid, he's surprising the hell out of me. Do you know what he's rocking now he's trying? Is that Denali. He says he freaking loves it. There's like a huge plate of uh, up the back. It's just, he loves it. It surprised the hell out of me. I'm not very good at, at that, uh, all the, all the, well, you know, for crying out loud, you know. Anyway, we're getting close here. This is, this is going to be, this is, this is a beautiful axe. Let's see if I can. Hey, Lyle Davis. Thank you, buddy. My son is 19. He's 19 years old. Oh, stillborn. It, it's coming up. I did a video on it. He freaking loves it. I'm, I'm straight goods. Weaver gave us that belt to try, right? I tried it. I liked it. It was comfortable as hell, but I, you know me, stillborn. I, I'm just give me a give me a freaking piece of leather. See, friends, my problem is is I've got no flexibility in my back. So for me to bend over and try and stick my legs, that's why I like that piece of leather. I literally grab it like this. I throw it on, and I don't. You know what I'm saying, right? No leg straps. Just go. That was what it was like for me forever. So yeah. So, so the Denali's wonderful. It's comfortable as hell. But stillborn, I'm telling you right now, after I threw those suspenders on, it was game on, brother. Game on. <laughs> yeah, thanks for, thanks for pounding me on that. Friends, this thing's got some blood on it. Look, there's a bit of blood on this axe. I was thinking about leaving it. Yeah, I got, I cut my finger. I was thinking about leaving it and burning over top of it. You know what I mean? Get a little blood in there. Yeah, it, you're right, Stillborn, I know. You're, you're absolutely right, buddy. And it's happened to me in the past, too. Howdy, Bucking. That phyllo plate is really hungry. Yeah, well, you, you, 35 degrees is a big bite, buddy. I think mine is, is 25 or 30. <laughs> if you've got a 35 degree, uh, that's, that's hungry for sure. <laughs> so yeah. Nopkin creations. Yes, I do, sir. Yeah. Just go to buckandbillyray.com. Yeah. The yank doodle just showed up. I think we're going to be okay. Friends. It looks like we we're doing okay here. I don't want to jinx myself, but I think we're doing okay. I want to see if I can make these uh, bigger. I'm going to see if I can make these... Uh,
All right. One sec. <laughs> hey, Jonathan, how are you, buddy? Yeah, yeah, I, I, I believe that's, if it's really hungry, that's probably why, because it says 35 on it. You know what I'm saying, buddy? Settings. I want to make my thing bigger, but I think I'm going to have to put it down, I think. Oh, here we go. Text size. There we go. Let's try that. Let's give that a shot. Aha. There we go. <laughs> Ontario, good to see you, buddy. Doug. <laughs> That's a little better. Well, I'm doing good, buddy. Thanks for asking. I'm doing good. Nice, good. So I could almost at this stage, friends, pound it on, but I need about a quarter inch. So I don't want to do that because you can you can have chance. You you and it's got you can have chance of breaking wood. You don't want to do that. Like we're we're close, friends. I need to take that down now. I'm not just gonna ram that on there and pound it on there. That's not a good not a good idea. Just give me a sec. See, I, I can almost, I can almost guarantee we're down there now. How long have you been collecting McCulloch's? Well, I, I've been cutting trees for many, many years, 25 years or something like that. So um, I got, I got heavy into collecting more so when the, when the channel, uh, you know, like five years I've been collecting more um, but I, I've been collecting for, for years and years, you know, my first, well, as you know, this, if you've been watching the channel, one of my first saws was a Mac and I ran the stank out of that thing. Uh, but then I went into heavy production fallen, which was Huskies, which still is Huskies when I do my production fallen. Uh, so yeah. Max, I've been collecting for years. I don't know how many exactly, but quite quite a few years now. <clears throat> yeah. But real hard again, real hard again for, you know, a good strong five. I've been, but remember too, friends, is folks send, send saws. You know, they'll, they'll call me and ask me if I want to buy power saws because of the channel. So the channels kind of help that out a bit. I don't know if it's helped it, but it's, uh, <laughs> it's brought them around. 
Yeah. Yeah, I'm back, Bear Paw. I'm back, buddy. <laughs> oh, how did that go, Lyle Davis? How was that? I'm going to go to Bunyan next year, too. Yeah, we're we're gonna we're gonna go to Bunyan next year. Probably me and my boy. Yeah, I got quite a few drums too. I'm getting rid of some of them. How you doing, Marshy? We should make a Marshy. You know what we should do next year? We're gonna have a we're gonna have buck and stock again, but we should try and make some big crazy two-week thing where we do buck and stock and then it falls into bunion or something like that like take two weeks off you know and do a great big thing <laughs> uh, oh did they yeah yeah i i i almost they were asking me to come this year the morgan's uh, we're talking about, you know, seeing if I could get out there and it just, it, it just didn't work this year, friends. Rich Ray, how are you, buddy? Great to see you. Rich, I came on, uh, a, a couple hours ago or an hour ago. Uh, yeah. And the Wi-Fi was screwing me up and I had a hell of a time. So I just checked out. So I'm back. I'm back. I have two trucks now, Terry, uh, Tyler, two old trucks. I'm sized right down. Well, I got the 96 Ford. It's a little newer. Oh, yeah, and Matt Man, good, good call. We got 149 people, so we're missing about 100 thumbs up, friends. Can you guys straighten that out for me? I think you can. If you're sitting there and you haven't hit the thumbs up yet, YouTube likes to see that. Thank you. There's a few there. They like to see the thumbs up. Okay, so I got to burn this handle now because I know that I, I did my final fit a couple seconds ago. I know that what I've got here now, I'll be able to ram that thing home now. Thank you very much. Thank you. Cool. Checking in from PA. Welcome. Yeah, we're going to burn it. Mr. Virtue, how are you, my friend? <laughs> but I think I'm going to leave that blood on there. See that? It's got some blood on. Should I leave the blood on it or sand it off? What do you guys think? Hey, it's got a whole bunch of it on there. I cut myself. Should we leave it? Leave it. Yeah, I think so too. Yeah. I did that before on a guy's axe. I was working on it and uh, and I cut my finger and it was a good one, eh? And I poured it on the axe and I, I left some blood on there. He loved it. Get the super glue. <laughs> yeah, no doubt. Wow, we got lots of comments coming in again, friends. Good to see you back. Good to see you back. Yeah, DNA, that's right. Okay. So let's burn this sucker. Let's do it. I know my fits there. And speaking of that, oh, friends. Oh, I'm getting my pistons going now. I'm feeling good now. Check this out. You may not see it. I got a crazy ax head here. Look at this. It was embossed. Look, can you guys see this? See the letters there? It's like a square with all kinds of crazy stuff. There's like a round, like a, like a, right there's like a round um, stamp or something. It's crazy. Okay. Let's burn. I can still see you guys right there.
How's everybody doing? <laughs> That's good. Okay, so after the final fit, I burn the sucker. I burn it. That way, when you put the head on, it blends in. You don't see a little white line because if you put your head on and then burn it, you know what happens. Let's do this. So we got our kerf. I had to make my kerf longer. See, it had a curve in it. They started it out like this. That's what they gave me. See, it went on an angle. So I brought it back into the center. Oh, yes, indeed, I darn well freaking did. Mr. Bell. You see that, friends? When you burn it, it swells. Yeah, see, that's good. Look at this. Yeah. And it's got the ribs in it, right, friends? See the ribs? So you end up with a space, right? Right there. We're not there yet. Hey, somebody super chatted. I missed it. Thank you very much, whoever that was. Sorry. Sorry I missed you guys. That's hot. What do we got? Oh, I guess I can read right there, but then I'm not looking at you. Oh, I want to show you this before I do this. Look at, see this? I'm almost at the top, okay? And I've been cracking on it. Check this out. <laughs> That's on there solid friends. It's not going no more. <laughs> Check this out. Hey, somebody super chatted. I missed it. Somebody did a super chat. Who was that? Friends, here, I'm going to check it. Move dog. Hey Sven, looking good. well, not too bad. You noticed I got my new shirt on, Mr. Move Dog. <laughs> it's nice to see you. This one is almost ready for the wedge. <laughs> Move Dog, you're a good man. You know, I, I can understand, uh, friends, that uh, when I do not come on the show, I, you miss me, I know. I am a very, uh, how can you say, a man with panache. I know, I know, it's hard not to see me for a long time. The move dog misses me. Here we are. Freaking Jatoba, deadly. Yeah. The land of the sleeping giant. Hey, say, how you doing, buddy? It's Hugh 381. Buddy, you should be sleeping by now. It's three o'clock in the morning there. 
<laughs> so you see what I'm going through right now? You see this? Look. See the spaces on the outside because of those freaking things? Look. Right? Yeah, look. But not in the kerf. So there's a little trick. Friends, seriously, this is what I do. You can imagine how tight that fit is on there right now. So what are the options? You take more wood down, take more wood, eh, then it goes on easier. Yes, it'll go on easier, for sure it will, but I'm not sure if I like that. There's space there, I've just gotta get it. Look at it all. Look at all that space. These are a bugger for some people. They are, friends. I get people asking me what I do. Well, this is what I do. I gotta go make my wedge, but first I gotta find out how much room I got there. So this is what I do. I get a screwdriver and I put it in here. Okay, this is what I do. See? I'm right in the kerf now. Look at the space. It's there, friends. So, and I just go like this now. Okay? A little bit like that. Whoa, Yank Doodle, you crazy bugger, you. Thanks, buddy. Friends, Yank Doodle super chatted. Let's give him a shout. Shout out for Yank Doodle. Okay, now, see? So now I can at least start my wedge. I couldn't before. Now, friends, that, there's no way that's going in there. Not a freaking chance. No, never. It's not gonna go down. Kevin Duff, how the hell are you, buddy? <laughs> hey, Joe Sweeney, good to see ya. Leonard Virtue. Leonard! Leonard, I got something for you. Hang on. for you, Leonard. Oh, I love Leonard. Leonard Virtue, he's been here a long time. Hey, there's Lumberzack. Cool. Hey, right on. <laughs> Sleep, or just gone to sleep. Oh, Yogi, you dirty dog. Nice, Kev, nice. Okay, now, this is important. These steps are important, friends. You can't jump over top of them. Don't, don't take shortcuts. I gotta find out how much I got in here. And I don't know if this is gonna work or not. This is gonna be a tough one. But I remember how much I put in there.
Here's another trick you can do, friends, if you want to get your kerf a little bigger. It takes some time. You see, can you guys see me here? Look. See the axe head right here? You just put, you put a little, so whoa, Jote, 307. Hey, buddy, thanks for the super chat. Cut a little away. There we go. Did you see that? It just went in. You see that? Right to the ground. There we go. So that's what I got right there. I need to know, friends. I need to know. It's beautiful. Look. I only need to take a little bit, but I'm not done. You see what's happening? Hey, Gainsies, good to see you again, buddy. Thank you, pal. Gainsies sent a super chat, friends. We gotta thank them. We gotta thank these people. <sighs> Look at this, friends. Look at this. I'm literally right there. Whoa, who was that? Daniel, keep killing it, bucking best channel on YouTube. Yay, thanks, buddy. Hey, I'm trying. I just don't really care. You know, I just throw up as much as I can. I love this community. I don't really have any times or guidelines. I just like coming here and seeing you guys. So thanks so much for saying that, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Rat Fink. Okay. We are getting somewhere now. Oh, yeah. I like it. Let's grab another one. This one works good too. Just bear with me, friends. Bear with me here. Okay, there it is. I got it. I'm right to the edge now. Oh yeah, there she goes, right there. Okay. Friends, this is good you're seeing this. If anybody's halved an axis, this is how I do some of this stuff. And I just, I just hang in there. Whoa, we got a low battery. I gotta crack, I gotta get this going. There we go. I had a low battery, friends. <laughs> Imagine that, bucking, gone again. <laughs> Check it out, friends. Look it. This is what I wanted, look. Oh yeah. We're there now, friends. Okay. Now. Let's go. 
You guys got to come outside. You guys can't miss this. I got a low battery, but you got to come out here anyway. Okay, I'll plug you in down here. Sorry, friends, about all this. Did you guys get battery? Did it charge? Okay. I think it did. Okay, friends. So now you need to find your size of your wedge up here. Not down here. This don't mean nothing. This, this don't mean nothing right now. It's this. This is what you want. You want to find your size. Okay? This thing's almost right on. Yeah, it is. I just need to round the edges. Look, friends. You see? I'm showing you this. Hey, listen friends this is this can be very deceiving I'm not kidding you this has happened to me once before and that's when I realized that this part here can be very very deceiving look at the space I have I have nothing in the kerf it's all on the outside well when you cram a solid granite piece of wedge down in there like Jatoba it's gonna squish that wood right into that handle but there's a fine line. So you want to think about how much wood you've got. I need to take more. I need to skinny this wedge up. Yeah. I think that's it. That's it. That's all I'm doing. Let's just go for it. Let's go. I'm not I'm not making that wedge any smaller, friends. Not when I got that look at all that space on the sides. I'm not going to do it. It's going to push that wood into that axe, okay? It's going to do it. And I don't I don't even care if I get the whole wedge right now. That's not that important to me, but look at how much wedge that is. That's a lot. I got a feeling I'm gonna get three quarters. That's just what I'm thinking. I've done so many. I think I'm gonna get three quarters. How do you feel about that? Is that pretty crazy? <laughs> this is the scary part for the hafter of the ax. Where am I putting you characters? Maybe here for now, just for now. Chris Woolbury. Hey, Chris. Hey, listen, I just seen you sneaking around doing a super chat, Chris. You think you're pretty sneaky, do you? <laughs> 
Thanks, Chris. We appreciate it. Friends, we need to thank Chris for the super chat. That's wicked, buddy. We appreciate the hell out of it, especially going into winter, pal. Thank you so much. I almost picked up my harmonica there for old Chris and blew another freaking toot for him. Here, let's do this. I got a feeling we got a little bit of glue here. Yeah, we do. Let's do this now. Oh yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Ooh, I must have pushed something down in there too. Ah, yes, indeed. Oh, that'll do it, won't it? <laughs> Did you see that, friends? <laughs> I rub it right in. Hey, thanks, John. Thank you. I appreciate it. 307, you crazy bugger. Thank you, buddy. I better not look down here and see thumbs up not looking good. I can't see from this far away, but if I come back there and those thumbs up aren't balanced out somewhat, I'll tell you. I'll tell you right now. <laughs> okay. I'm a maniac. Maniac. You ready? Let's do it. Look. Here we go. You guys ready? Okay. Okay. Check this out. I, and I was wailing on it. You guys see me. You felt the ground shaking, right? We still got wedge to go. We do but I can, I can feel it. It's hard, like really hard. So we got, looks like we got more than half the wedge. I'm gonna go for more, but I'm just showing you the process. Chris Woolbury, fire up the harmonica. Oh, you think you, think you can get away with that kind of crap? Oh, here down at this channel? You think you can get away with that, Chris? You, you don't think I'm crazy and wild? You, you, you got your doubts on Uncle Buck and Billy Ray here? I'm gonna lay down the freaking uh, little blues harp on you. I had the high key going. I'm gonna drop it down a little bit for you here, down in the depths of the Mississippi. of the blues and the craziness for you. That was for you, buddy. Chris. <laughs> that glue's drying. Let's get going. Enough horsing around. Let's go. Ah, 
That is it. Look at where'd you guys go? <laughs> Look at that. We got quite a bit, friends. You gotta like it. Yeah. So you, you can imagine what, what just happened, eh, friends? Do you know what I'm saying? You can imagine what just happened with that, eh? With those grooves in there, into that wood. It's crazy. Wow. <laughs> Hang on a sec. All right, that is crazy. <laughs> We've only got a little bit. I like my axes a little prouder than that, friends. Like I usually like my axes a little prouder. But this one is so wide here. Like, you know what I mean? Like the jerseys are so wide. Look at where I'm at. Look at, I'm literally right on the freaking, I'm right at the shoulder, at the turn of the shoulder. Do, do you want to take this outside and just wallop on it, beat the pulp out of it? It ain't going anywhere. That is a nice ax, friends. Oh yeah. Gorgeous. Love you too, Stevie. Thanks, buddy. What the hell? Sully. No. You. Friends, did you just see what Sully just did? Kevin Sullivan, you crazy. Buddy, thank you so much, pal. Thank you. You, you didn't have to go and do that. Thank you so much, buddy. <laughs> oh, man. What? Oh. Hey, Sully, you crazy bugger, you, you son of a gun. Get after it, Sully. Hey, Sully, when's the last time you seen a flat top come out of this shack, hey? Hey, is that a decal? It is decal, son of a gun. Friends, say hello to decal, he's on. I'm gonna go inside. Maybe we should go throw it. Should we go throw it? <laughs> That's a damn nice ax. I'm talking damn nice. Let's put a little watch on it. Friends, let's put some watch on her. And then I'm gonna, I'm gonna go in and hang out with my wife and have some supper. I said that two hours ago. No, it was an hour actually. Hey friends, you can thank the landfill rat too. 
He's always on the search for me for these things. Look at this one. This one's crazy. It's deadly. The landfill rat, he always on the lookout for these things. Yeah. Leonard Virtue, what time is it at your place? Okay. I got to put some gloves on. I started wearing a mask. Hey. Friends, there's freaking 300 people here. I didn't see that. I just looked, there's 300 freaking people. <laughs> Yahoo! That's a good one. Hey. He's a maniac, maniac, I sure know. It's dusty. There's blood on this axe. Hey, thanks. Thanks, thank you. <laughs> Look at this. For those of you who've just checked in, the last five or eight people, now there's a 308 people. Hey, listen, that's a lot of people. You know what I'm saying? That's a hell of a lot of people. to the vodka, back to the job at hand here, enough playing around. <laughs> we got blood. What's that old song? Blood on the plow? Well, there's blood on the plow tonight. All right. Okay. You gotta get that sucker on there hard. Now lay that sucker down. Lay on until you right now. All right. Okay, I don't think I wubbed the axe off. There it is, a bucking special. Let's go outside. Hey, Kevin, Sully. That last discussion we had, Kevin, are you still on, Sully? Talk to me, brother. Excuse me. I'm looking for Sully. We got 311 people here. That's pretty crazy. 
it, it was nuts. I tried to get, oh man, it was terrible. I tried to get uh, the live feed going. Okay, Sully's there, good. Sully, well, the last time we talked, you talked about a wedge banger, didn't you? I know that you said anything would be good, but you got lots of axes, but you said a wedge banger might be most handy. Is that correct, sir? I think it is, isn't it? Well, you're getting a combination axe. I already know the axe I'm sending you, and it's absolute, because you're an axe man. You got some axes, don't you? Sully's got some axes, but you don't have a wedge banger. I know, I read your email. I went back and looked in your email. I remember what you said. Oh, yes, I did, my friend. <laughs> it's not this one, don't get excited. Gotta get the feel of this sucker. Every axe has a different feel, friends. Every single one. And a jersey kind of wobbles. Yeah, I see it. it. Goes like this. You see that go like that? That's because of this big freaking this thing here. Not a good thrower. Look at this sucker, friends. Maybe we'll try a backwards one, eh? Nailed it. We nailed it. It's actually a nice axe, but it's not, it's not a throwing axe. I just like throwing stuff. There's that last hit. Hey, all right. <laughs> oh, did it freeze? Did it freeze when I threw the axe? Did it friends? Are you serious? It froze and then the axe was in the wood. Is that what happened? No. I don't go out on freeze. No, that's not how bucking rolls. You know, you're, you, all you got is your freaking word. What's gonna happen when you're gone? Seriously, I'm being, I'm being serious. What, what happens when you're gone? What happens when you're on site and you're working? And then you leave. Well, guess what happens if you didn't work that hard? You're gonna get talked about. You wanna get talked, you're getting talked about anyway. You just are, you're getting talked about. So why not pound it? And why not just work as hard as you can and be honest and, 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 and do the best you can? Because you know you got it in you, right? Because you're going to be talked about either way. The crew's going to be like, so what do you think? Yeah, I don't know. Leave no room for scrutiny, friends. None. Leave no room. Show up on site and just hands out. Just what... What, what do you, where, over there, where, there, here, there, where? I'm gonna run, watch me go. Boom, bing, bang, what's next? Just work here, work it, work it. Because there's people out there that are gonna do that and if they're doing it and you're not, you might get called back and you don't want that. But back to the thing I was talking about, when you're gone, I mean gone, gone, gone to the next place, back home, so to speak, back to God, when you go back, you're gone, but you're not forgotten. People remember what you were like. They remember, I mean, you remember people who, who died. Don't you got some friends that died? Don't you remember what they were like? What do you want to be remembered as? Start building that now. Start, start that now. I, uh, 20, 23 years ago, I wouldn't have wanted to be remembered as that guy going out that way. I would not have wanted that but I changed it around. I, if I went tomorrow, I'll tell you right now, if I went tomorrow 
And you hear people say this, but I mean it right in my guts. If I was gone tomorrow, I know that I would rest easy and sleep well. I'll tell you that right now. I love working. <laughs> I do. I love it. I'm a physical dude. I love helping. I love being in the mix with people. Just get in there. I've never been a sideliner. Never. I don't know why the hell I'm talking like this, but it's a, it's the live feed and I screwed up or the, we got screwed around on the live feed last time. We tried like three or four times. I thought you guys would be sick and tired of him by then. But I said, forget it. I can't go out like that. I'm not going out like that. So I turned on the old trusty iPhone and we managed, I said, I'm just gonna build the ax. And if somebody comes around, they wanna talk back to forth to one another, cause that's what we do in these places. We see somebody we know, we go, hey, how's it going? Yo, how you doing? Hey, of course we do. That's what we do, we're human beings, we interact. We weren't meant to be alone here. We were meant to get to know ourselves and then go, right? Find who you are, create who you wanna be. Man, we're, life is so fun that way. You get to create yourself to who you want to be. I was haywire. I was haywire. And I didn't want to be that dude no more. I wanted to be a different dude. I'm still haywire. Don't kid yourself. Don't kid yourself for a second. <laughs> but I got a straight head and a sober mind. I don't miss much these days. <laughs> Friends, listen, I gotta go. I gotta go. Listen, thank you for popping in. Hey, Stump Jumper, I seen you at that freaking, uh, at that freaking thing there, that chop chop place. What's it called? Bunyan, I seen you on the camera at the Morgans. You were calling me out. Buddy, I wanna come down. I'm not joking you, I do. We gotta, it's just about timing. Are you gonna be at that place for a while? Are you gonna be cutting there for a little while? Give me some time to get some stuff straightened out here. I'll come down. I am so thankful and honored and I'm looking you right in your face over there because that don't mean nothing really. This does, well, it all means, but that, I know you're looking at me, Stumper. You offered to get me down there, you and your wife, and I thank you right now, buddy. Thank you so much. That's, a, that's a, an, an honorable offer and I will accept that from you. When the timing's right, I'll take you up on it. I'll come down and we'll have some fun down there, buddy. It'll be a blast, but I wanted to thank you for offering up that plane ticket like that. That's a lot, and I appreciate the hell out of that. So thank you so much, buddy. I appreciate it. Okay. Now, I gotta move in here. Hey, what? I can't see nothing no more, eh, friends? My eyes? <laughs> yeah. That was fun. We got to build an ax live. I've always wanted to do that. Okay, back in the bunker. Where's my thing? Okay, let's close this shack down. Hey, uh, Stumpy, I sent you some, I sent you some texts. I don't know if you, yes, Billy, I'm there for many months. Oh, okay. You too, buddy. Oh, okay, good. Okay, good. That's very good. Save the big ones for me, Stumper. <laughs> Cause I'll, I'll get Iron Horse to send me down a rip roar and saw. I'm coming. Stumper, I'm coming. It's just timing. We'll make it happen. See you. Hey, Joel, Joel Cray Romeric. Awesome. Friends, good night. I love you all. Two Mule Team, great to see you. Lyle Davis, you're a hell of a man. I know, look at them. <laughs> uh, you guys are awesome. Hey, Auction Indiana, buddy, I love you. Good to see you. I gotta go. Decal, take care. I'm a maniac, maniac. <laughs> Have a good week, friends. Be kind out there. Over and out.